from the Los Angeles Lakers, number 13, Brooke Chamberlain. At center from the Milwaukee Bucks, is 33, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. And you can tell this is a Laker town. Kareem and Wilt hated each other in those days because Kareem was the young lion coming up to take all of Wilt's records and Wilt wasn't going to let it happen. He presented to me for the first time a guy that I felt, at least at my state at that time, that I really needed some help to guard. Watching Wilt and Kareem Wool one on one was phenomenal. It was fun to watch those guys back in against each other. Look at Javar lean on Chamberlain. The two seven-footers waged a personal war that would have basketball fans talking for months. Yes, maybe even years. It's a standoff between the guys in the middle. I don't know what the statistics are. Lou had 32 and 22 rebounds. And Will 22 points and 20 rebounds. And those stats are misleading, I think, because these two guys are pretty much at a standoff in that the Bucks go more to Javar on offense. Pass for Kareem Javar. Just the basket. Almost loses the Perry. Good with Happy Hurston, Jim McMillan, Wolf Chamberlain for Los Angeles. Jabbar over Chamberlain, won't go, tips it in. Milwaukee Arena against the defending world champions, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar against Wolf Chamberlain. This time he gives it up to Lucius Allen. Chamberlain gives it to Hairston. Jabbar, clean block. Beautiful play by Kareem Jabbar. Working against Kareem Jabbar, goes up over his head, missed it. And the greatest offensive weapon ever unleashed, you know, in the NBA. Here is Abdul-Jabbar inside against Chamberlain. Jabbar and Chamberlain. There's nowhere to block that shot. I don't recall ever being blocked by somebody who's guarding me. Wilt was pretty good, too. Wilt tried to time it, and he could really beat, but he just couldn't get there in time. I think here we have, the, in the battle of the big man already, Bill, we have Abdul-Jabbar trying to get he was yeah, uh, he's trying to establish position, so to speak. Uh, he's going to take the straight to the road. Uh, maybe try to discourage or get him down. The Battle of the Giants. The 12-year veteran, Will Chamberlain, against the second-year pro, Al Sindor. At 24 years of age, Lou had led the Bucks to the best record in the NBA, had been named the league's most valuable player, and was the scoring speech that he's ever made. We all hold up and he made a comparison to himself and Bill Russell. He said, listen, I've always been the best center in the league, but I never had the right teammates. I was better than Russell, but Russell had the best teammates and Russell won. Now, this young kid, Jabbar, is the best center in the league. We, the Lakers, had a better supporting cast than what Kareem had. Let's get this thing over with right now. The sooner the better. Don't give them any more hope. Wilt knew that, uh, that he was the guy on the team that we looked up to, that uh, he was a guy that was going to help us win. Jamin looks for a cutter, eight in the timer. Jerry West, back to Chamberlain, back to Jerry. Chamberlain tries to go to Hairston, gets it to him, and Happy makes it. We have to contain, you know, each individual to a certain extent, but we have to go out there for the team, and that's what uh, is on my mind. It's just what we can do best uh, to stop their team. The world is much better defensively, and I think that in order to break the game open, you got to stop the other guys. Will's forced him out of the bit, so he has taken no longer shots than he normally takes. Fine move by Jabbar, but he misses the hook shot. Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, four out of nine from the field so far. That is below his average field goal percentage. He's going to 
go for the hook. This it again. Happy Harris from the rebound. Again, it's a bad shot. I don't think that's his normal shot. He's trying to get it over the big guy. Now, Javar has, uh, has not been shooting well, mainly because he hasn't taken a shot he likes to take. I mean, Wood's pushing him out, physically pushing him out, and then he's taking too much time on his shots. Javar missing. Chamberlain for the rebound. McMillan missed the shot. Wilkins right there. Here's the shot by Goodrich. Chamberlain inside has the ball. Has to come out with the ball between McMillan and Perry. And an offensive foul is called on Jabbar. So Kareem Abdul-Jabbar picks up the offensive foul. Jabbar. And Happy Hairston goes down hard and Jabbar is hot. And Ricky Power steps in very quickly between Will Chamberlain and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. He didn't really want to get him mad, but he could play the whole team by himself. I tell you one thing, Will Chamberlain is a very angry man right now. Will Chamberlain, the big captain's In the fourth quarter, Will just took over the game. Chamberlain played with a determination he hadn't shown in years. They try to go inside to Abdul-Jabbar. Chamberlain gets the ball. Nice play. In it goes for Jabbar. Chamberlain takes it away. Abdul-Jabbar against Chamberlain. Wilk took it away from him. Good defensive play by Wilk. Here come the Lakers. And that's Dandridge in the corner. And it goes to Jabbar. Jumps it up over Wilk. Wilk blocks it. In it goes to Abdul-Jabbar. Chamberlain spoiled it. In the Jabbar. Jabbar against Wilk. Out of the way by Wilk. Chamberlain blocked it. Great play by Chamberlain. I block three of this guy looks in a row. Puts it up, Chamberlain blocks it. Puts it up, Chamberlain blocks it. It's one of the finest defensive plays I've ever seen in that. Jamar against Will. Batted away by Will. Chamberlain takes the ball. I had to do it before it's harder. And I had to kind of run harder and do some things that were a little bit different and see how he would handle the defensive play. Will to take the play. Jamar knocks the ball loose from Will and commits the personal foul. He just feels. Wilt's there, puts it up, and in, Chamberlain, basket counts, foul. Wilt said, I am going to make sure that we win. And he had a score of about eight or ten points for two or two or three minutes to give us a chance to win the game. Well, here's Chamberlain, over the bar. That time, Kareem backed up a little and gave in, I think, rather than contest Chamberlain. Chamberlain had 24 points. Pull down, 24 rebounds, and a complete no goal without a finger. Backing in, underneath, finger roll. Pass is under to Will, he's got it. He puts it up and slams it. Will Chamberlain getting in quick. Will Charmin and Jones out of play, Jamar. And he's driving Jamar crazy. The big difference put on quite a shift. Chamberlain and Dark. Underneath to Will, he's driving Dark. The three feet fires it. Zip Zinnick comes out, does it. Great rebound by Will. Wisconsin Rooters gave the Dipper one of the sincerest, most impressive ovations he had received in his career. He said he was overwhelmed. When Kareem Abdul-Jabbar passed his record 31,419 career points, Chamberlain was gracious. I think it's a great accomplishment for Kareem to break the record. And I think he's deserving of it. When you talk about the greatest basketball player of all time, well, it should be in a discussion. Jordan hasn't come close to doing what